Hi guys, it's TMNC. In this video, I am gonna share a story of Freddie Mercury and Roger Taylor. At first, I want to tell you sorry for the audio quality. My mic is broken and it's locked down here, so I can't buy a new one. Okay, so now let's begin the story. And if you guys don't know this, so let me tell you. Freddie Cohen and Rand, a small stall in Kingston Market in London with Roger Taylor, which opened in the summer of 1969. They sold Freddie's own artwork as well as second-hand clothes. The two of them kept up running the stall even after Queen released their first album in 1973. So Brian made this story and I'm gonna tell you what Brian said. Roger and Freddie were the proprietors of a little shop, probably stole the clothes to sell them. There is some good stories about that. Freddie didn't like to talk about it but I will. Freddie and Roger used to argue about who owned what and I can remember one time Freddie had his own jacket which he was very proud of and he hung at the door when he went out for the coffee. Well, when he got back, he found that Roger had sold it while he was gone. So Freddie went running after the guy and literally rips it off the guy's back and gives him the money. And the story is more intense than that. Freddie threatened to kill Roger if he doesn't get the jackets back. Freddie was very much emotionally attached to that jacket and Roger didn't knew that. He thought, Freddie thought that it made him look like Jimi Hendrix when he wore that. Roger didn't knew. Roger almost cried when he, Freddie said him that. He sold that jacket only because he was very desperate for money. They were very poor and were working for foods and Roger had hardly got 20 pounds for it anyway but it had have meant something to eat that day or maybe a ride home. Those boys were starving. Poor Roger didn't realize how much Freddie was attached to that jacket. Anyway, Freddie, Roger got relieved when Freddie got that jacket back. So thanks for watching and tell us in comment this section what do you think about it. Thank you.